All right, greetings everybody, Del Puckett here, and in this video I'm gonna do my best to try to explain to you the theory behind just intonation. All right, so just intonation is actually more than just a musical note, uh, temperament um, thing. What it is is more of a vibration system. All right, so here on the three string cigar box guitar, we tune this one, five, one, and it could be any one, five, one, as long as that interval is there, one, five, one. Okay, so, Whatever key that you tune it into is going to be vibrating at a certain frequency. All right, well, this 12th fret position represents exactly halfway in between the nut and the saddle. And this is where the first harmonic exists, right? And so if you divide the string in half, this is the first position. All right, well, the next harmonic occurs at the 7th fret, and it is down here. This is dividing the string into three, and this is the second spot. The next harmonic occurs at the 5th fret, and that's like dividing the string by four, and this is the third spot. All right, and then so the major third, that is dividing the string by five, and this is the fourth spot. This is the minor third, and the minor third is dividing the string by six, and this is the fifth spot. All right, so we jump down here to the major second, that's divide by nine, and this is the eighth spot, and then the minor second, that is divide by 16, and this is the 15th. So, um, this one here is not exact. The one I'm working on now is a lot more exact. This is according to the template. This one here I did according to my ear, which is actually pretty close when I compare it. My uh, flatted 7th or the 10th fret there, I opted for the 8 over 3 division as opposed to either the 7, 4 or the uh, 9, 5 there. So anyhow, so just intonation is basically just a mathematical division of the string based on the harmonic series of the string. And, you know, you can get out a ruler and measure these intervals, and you'll see that they're exactly right on. This template here was computer-generated and laser-cut. All right, so where these harmonics exist are at these mathematical divisions. So we have the nut here on the left, and its ratio is 1 over 1. There is, is no division. The first fret is 16 over 15. The second fret, 9 over 8. You're going to jump over the 7 6, which is they call the septimal minor, minor third. And if you want the normal sounding minor third, you're going to go to that 6 over 5 ratio. The major third is a 5 over 4 ratio. The fourth is a 4 over 3 ratio. There's a bunch of different harmonics that exist at the flat 5. Some of the popular ones are 32 over 15 or uh, what is that, 45 over 32. The seventh fret or the perfect fifth is divide the string into three equal parts and this is the second node or a 3 over 2 ratio. The minor sixth and the major sixth the flatted seventh there, I opt for the eight over three interval as opposed to any of these others. The major seven is divided by 15, and this is the eighth spot. And then finally, the octave is basically dividing the string in half, and this is the first node, which is really the only node. So there you have all 12 notes, the mathematical divisions represented as ratios, and each one of these correlating to the major scale tones.